McBaby Monday. McBaby Monday. It's McBaby Monday. Hi guys, it's Eric and Adam and today is an exciting day because in front of all of you we are going to be doing our genetic testing that we got in the mail. Well, we're not going to be doing the genetic testing. Well, no, but... Because I wasn't mentally prepared to do it right now. I, we're just opening the box. Oh no, we're doing it. Lies. Are you serious? Yes. Oh my god, really? Yes. What if it's like... I think it's just like a swab, like you do a swab in your mouth. I think that's it. Okay. But we're gonna unveil it. We got it uh, from a company called Recombine, which is actually working with our uh, fertility center. Uh, they're based out of New York. They sent it to us. Uh, we had the option of either having it sent to us or going to the clinic in San Diego. And this is just easier. So they sent it to us. We have decided to do the full scale of 300 plus uh, genetic background tests. Um, so let's see what is inside. I'm wearing a shirt to match my nails. Yay! Yay! They do totally match, yeah. Wow, if you do this, it doesn't look like you have nails. It just blends in with the shirt. <laughs> All right, so we're taking it out. Recombine. Well, Recombine. And there's two of them in here. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. So this says saliva kit. You probably... It's, oh, yeah. perfect. See? Oh, so it's, it's two... Like that's swap. it? That's it? One for you, one for me. <sighs> we're done! Oh, what did you think? Because th you were like, oh, it might be a prick. I'm like, we're going to have to, like, draw blood. They drew that's blood, that's like... like a little... Oh, speaking of which, uh, so our whole splurging in a cup that was supposed to happen last Friday right. never actually happened. I had mentally prepared myself to splurge all over the walls, but it never ended up happening. They just took seven vials of blood. I'm like, okay, vampire, bye. Well, it's a good thing we, we wouldn't have been able to do it anyway because I was sick. He was really sick, and so. so. And I had a fever, and they said that it kills off sperm if you have a fever. If your yeah. body has so much heat that it actually... You know, but I was really disappointed. I was like, I'm ready. But... What, 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 you... Oh my gosh, I'm sorry, sorry. All right, Ear so recombine. And now we're going to open it. Ooh. Ooh. Do not eat, drink, smoke, or chew gum for at least 30 minutes prior to sample collection. Eat, drink, smoke, or chew gum. Well, we didn't know that. So we'll be back in about 30 minutes because I just had some water. You did? Yeah, before we went downstairs. Oh. I didn't have anything, so I can do it. Okay. Well, you can do it, and we'll just watch you. So it has the sample instructions inside. And complete forms, collect sample, spit into tube until amount of saliva reaches the fill to line. My god, what if I'm too dry? Following the instructions below, place one completed patient identifier sticker on the tube. Place tube in the biohazard bag and seal the bag. What is that? It's already, somebody already spit in mine. There's liquid no, inside of it there. Just, it just helps to maintain whatever you're putting into it. I'm like, I already got a used one. There's so, there's so much stuff in here. So, Oh, we that's have... really cool. They have like a mailing back oh, cool. package that you can mail Yay. this back. So they, it came with a form that has our info filled out, but then we have to fill out the rest. And then it came with a biohazard bag, which uh, I don't think Eric will fit into this, but we can try and shove him in there. And then the carrier map. What is a carrier map? Comprehensive genetic carrier screen. Ooh, exciting. So the mutations that can cause many genetic diseases included cystic fibrosis, fragile X syndrome, uh, spinal muscular atrophy. Sickle cell disease, alpha and beta. Oh, it started off real strong. Thalassemia <laughs> and tay sachs disease. Why do they all have to be really hard to pronounce? Uh, so those are the main ones that we're testing for, but we are testing for about 200 and something more. Yeah. Um, so 
Oh, this is really cool. If one partner is a carrier of an uh, autosomal recessive disease, the risk of having an affected child is significantly reduced, but not eliminated. Additionally, testing may be available to further refine this risk. If both partners are, re are carriers of the same disease, uh, autosomal, autosom autosomal recessive genetic disease, <laughs> the risk of having an affected child is one in four or 25%. What happens next? Your sample will be sent to Recombined Laboratory and processing will begin immediately after one to two weeks. You'll be notified that your results are ready and then you can schedule an appointment to review your results and discuss next steps with the genetic counselor. So the really cool thing is, is I think you can actually, anybody can go on. So if you guys want to find out about your genetics oh, and yeah. stuff, so you can go on. You don't um, even have to be like involved in the surrogacy no. process. If you're just curious and you can go and you can look, which is really cool and you can order it yourself. Mm -hmm. um, we're lucky because of the partnership that they have, it's actually only $25 for us, which is really exciting. Otherwise, it's closer to 400 So you got $400 laying around and you wanna check your genetics, go for it. <laughs> All right, so this is what the this little is fascinating. sample looks like. I know, I've been excited for this actually. The fact that it comes um, with a biohazard bag makes me think that already something is wrong with me. So you're going to spin to the cup, it looks like, until the fill two line, and then you're going to close the lid until you hear a loud click. Then you're going to unscrew the funnel and replace with blue cap. Then shake the capped tube for five seconds. Place the sealed biohazard bag and completed forms in the kit. Place the kit in the provided FedEx clinical pack and seal the bag. Oh, because we're putting this in back in here to send back. Got it. So this drop goes kit off in the of any FedEx drop box or schedule pickup. So this goes in the biohazard bag, then goes in the FedEx thing. Correct. Okay. Awesome. Chop chop. Start spitting. Are you serious? Uh huh. Can I touch it? So I just go? Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> this is gonna be the best video ever. <laughs> you complain with wires to know it's good. Okay, so that's it. Alright, so next thing you do is <clears throat> close the lid until you hear a loud click. This lid? Yep. Perfect. Okay. Unscrew the funnel and replace with a blue cap. Okay. And then you're gonna replace it. Oh my god, there's a bubble. Blue cap. Oh, the bubble popped. Now shake the caps tube for five seconds. Tick tock, baby, we're alone in the city And there's only 30 seconds to go Yay! Awesome. What happened to your fingertips, Eric? So, that's yep. already done, so I just do this. Yep. Put that in there. And you're gonna seal that. Perfect, and you put it in there. Oh my god, this is the biggest envelope. This is the biggest envelope for this tiny little thing. <laughs> really? We had to have a giant size it's like this? Huge. Okay. Perfect. So we will complete these forms, put this in the bag, and then we will send it off to recombine, and we'll get our genetic testing back, and that is that. Fingers crossed, there's nothing wrong with us. Yay! I, I'm pretty sure everyone has fallen asleep. So interesting. <laughs> no, this is really cool. Um, so our egg donor will have to do the same, we found out, um, because there's certain things that clearly you just read that the female may be carrying to pass on and we'll get to know all those stuff. So thank you for watching today's unveiling of our recombined kit. Thank Saliva you for watching kit. a spit in a thing. Me too. <laughs> Super exciting for you all. I know. I know, yeah. But uh, we hope that you learned a little more about the process of what we're going through. Uh, if you like what you watch, make sure that you subscribe, make sure you comment, ask us any questions you may have, give us a thumbs up, and also we're gonna put down all the information about Recombine down below. So if you're interested in doing it, just because, there you go, we're giving you the information. Uh, but thank you for watching and we'll see you soon. Three!